my name is Ariel Schmidt, owner of Tranquility Rising, and I am here to walk you through our booking system. If you've had kind of questions or felt overwhelmed about how to book or purchase programs, then you're in the right place. So if you want to follow along with me, you can head to tranquilityrising.com. And I'm just going to start sharing my screen with you and we will get started. So if you find yourself on tranquilityrising.com and you're not sure where to start, you'll notice that if you scroll down to the bottom, there's these two buttons that say book your next appointment, purchase programs, packages, and gift cards. And you'll notice this little note here, when booking, don't forget to log in and create a free member profile. So that is always my first step when people ask me how to get started. You're going to create that member profile. So up in the upper left-hand corner, you see this log in button and you'll click on that. And if you're a brand new person, never been to Tranquility Rising before, you're gonna sign up as a member by filling in all of this and check marking these liability boxes. If you click into this registration form, don't worry about any of the fees that you might see in there. We take care of all of that. Um, if you are a member, already, you're going to click log in, and then you have a couple options. You can log in with Google or an Apple, depending on what you're on, um, or log in with your email. I recommend logging in with your email. That way, if you decide to purchase or not purchase, but download the free app that comes with our website, you'll be able to just seamlessly log in without any glitches. Um, sometimes if you have an Android phone, but you used your Apple ID, those don't mix very well. So email is always best. All right. I'm just going to pause my share so I can log in. And here we are. I just clicked that login button and it brought up all my information. So a couple things over here underneath this booking tab or this login tab, I should say, it has a few distinct options. It has your profile, your bookings and your subscriptions. So the only thing you're ever really gonna be concerned about are two things. And it's gonna be right here, my bookings, and right here, my subscriptions. My bookings is going to show you all of your upcoming appointments and any past appointments that you've had. Your subscriptions is going to be any packages that you purchase with us or any programs that you're a part of, okay? So I'm gonna click under my bookings and you guys are gonna see the history for this profile. So you'll notice that they have a new client appointment booked and also a 90 minute. These are all test options. So they're a little out of whack with the dates. Um, but when you're here, it will also show you your history. So let me pretend that you guys are all brand new clients and then we'll come back to this profile and kind of walk you through how everything works. So if you're a brand new client, you're going to start with book your next appointment. That's the only place that you should be concerned about heading. And we click there and it's automatically going to bring you up to our new client offerings. Our new client offerings are for every single practitioner that we have at the studio. So no matter what you want to do, there is always going to be that start point as a new client, okay? So you can click any of these options and you can book a session with them. And since we are doing a test, I'm just gonna book with myself so I don't confuse our other practitioners and making sure that they don't get these random email notifications. So I click that book now appointment and we're just going to find a time on the calendar that is free, that works for you. So we'll go with this 27th and we'll click afternoon. 
And then you're going to notice over here is the next button. And it's going to bring you to a booking form and it's going to have you fill out any questions that are related to that service. So each practitioner has different questions that they like to know about you before coming in. And so that's what's going to come up next. So we will type in that phone number and this is just the studio's phone number. And again, here are all those questions that I have my clients answer for the Thai client sessions. Again, some practitioners, maybe they only have one question. Um, some have a few, extra few. And then at the end of every booking option, you have, do you want to receive SMS reminders 24 hours before your session starts? So if you're a person who really enjoys that extra reminder through the text message, click that option. If that's not something you like, just leave it blank and you can always change your preferences later, okay? And then if for some reason we're running a special or, you know, someone gifted you the session, you've probably been given a coupon code to enter. So that would be here. And since I am doing a test, actually, I'll show you what the checkout looks like. So if you go to pay now, it's going to bring you again into this payment. And I think I'm on the wrong web browser for this to actually work. <laughs> It'll keep timing. Um, if this happens to you, just change your browser. Use um, Google Chrome. I'm using Safari, so it doesn't seem to want to work for me. Probably I need to do my cookies or something. But this will come up, and then you'll click Pay Now. Okay. All of our sessions are prepaid. Um, and that is just to help make sure that you're showing up for your sessions and you're following our cancellation policy, which is to reschedule or cancel a session 24 hours in advance. Okay, so I'm going to put in our test coupon code. And when we do this, you'll notice that the discount is applied and the total is zero. So you might have like a 20, dollar off coupon or maybe a 10% coupon or again if someone gifted you a session then you'll have this full amount deducted with whatever your unique coupon code is when you click pay now it's going to bring up this congratulations you've booked and you can add it straight to your calendar from there which i think is one of the most useful tools that has come out and then you're done. All you have to do is show up for your session and then the practitioners will walk you through um, their services, how to book with them, their programs and things like that. Okay. Now, if you went through that new client session and you didn't wanna purchase your package or program with your practitioner in the studio and you wanted to kind of go home and think about it, and now you're ready to move into that program or package, that's where this next part comes in, okay? So think of purchases and, or your programs and packages, those are considered subscriptions, okay? You're going to use your subscription or use your credits to book future sessions, okay? So that's what that looks like. So when you go purchase programs, package and gift cards, that's gonna be, every practitioner offering their program or potentially a discounted package for multiple sessions if you want to continue working with them. So you'll notice that every single session or every single package comes with an expiration date. So there's eight weeks, 15 weeks, four months, it just depends on the package that you're booking. So make sure to keep that in mind. If you have a really crazy busy schedule and you don't think you can get X number of sessions in during that time frame, then maybe purchasing single sessions in the meantime is the best way to go. 
because if you allow your package to expire, you use and you lose any of those unused credits. Okay, so make sure you're paying attention to that. And there's a really simple way to keep track of that. And I'm going to show you that in just one moment. So if you decided to go home and think about working with one of our practitioners, but now you're ready to say yes, you'll click the package that you want. And again, you will literally just go through the payment section and you're done, okay? Then all of your subscriptions are going to pop up in your member profile, okay? So think of, again, you have to purchase the package first and then you get credits added onto your account to use for future bookings, okay? So we're gonna go under my subscriptions. We just purchased this subscription and it is sitting right here in our subscriptions, right? So it gives us our expiration date. And if we use this little drop down arrow, it's going to show you how many sessions are remaining. Okay, there's six sessions remaining in this program. And if we go, oh, I thought this program came with seven, it does, but one has already been booked for us. So it's going to um, keep us deducting, okay? I used this profile as an example earlier today. So that's why they are missing one of their sessions. If I go over to their bookings, it's going to show up that they have a session booked. So here is the history of their booking. And here is that 90 minute Thai yoga session with that package, okay? If you want to reschedule or cancel a session, it's super easy. You just have to make sure you're doing it 24 hours in advance from your session. So let's go ahead and cancel some of these out because these were our test ones that I used earlier and it's as simple as just click and confirm. And now you're no longer scheduled for that session. If we do this for this session, this 90 minute session, and you'll see it's part of a seven session protocol. If we cancel that session, your credit will be given back to you, okay? So let's cancel and confirm. And if we head back to subscriptions for just a moment, you're gonna notice, again, we have to go to that drop down. You're gonna notice there are now seven sessions back in this account. So it keeps things really easy for you guys to keep track of what you need to book, how many you need to book, and when your expiration comes in. Okay, if you are ready to book something from your package, you just click book your next appointment. And you're gonna notice that after new client offerings, there are several different tabs at the top of our services. So there are Thai Yoga, there's some add-on services, and that is specifically for my services. And then there are energy healing sessions. So this is gonna be Kimberly and Katie Garber. There are lifestyle sessions, which is going to be with Katie Vinecourt and Sapna. And then we have our events and trainings at the studio as well. But if we're talking about booking our appointment with our package that we just purchased, you go to the service menu that your package is connected to. And so you purchase a seven session Thai yoga protocol, which has seven separate Thai sessions, six 90 minute and one two hour. So we are going to go in and book 
Again, scrolling through this online calendar to see what's available, clicking the date that works for you, and then the time slot that's available. And you're gonna notice that you don't even have the option to pay for this session because you have this subscription, okay? You have seven out of seven sessions remaining. And so you literally can't pay for a session if you have a subscription that you need to use. Just make sure, because we've had this in the past, make sure you are logged in when you go to book your appointment, because if you're not logged in, the system doesn't know that you have a protocol or a program that you want to redeem from. And then yes, it's gonna prompt you to pay and then you'll be double paying. So make sure you're logged in and then you should be able to click next and you'll put in your information and you'll click book it. And boom, all done. You're going to notice that right here, it tells you you have six out of seven sessions remaining now, and you can go right back in, book your next appointment and your next appointment and your next appointment until you no longer have any sessions left. Or if it's a package, like a three session package that you can use over four months, maybe you just wanna book one session now, and then in a couple of weeks, come back and book your next session and so on and so forth. So it's completely up to you how you want to book. You can book up to three months in advance. So if you're a planner and you know your life gets really busy, just book those sessions out because you can always reschedule up to 24 hours in advance if you need to. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else. We talked about the bookings and the subscriptions. Those are the only two things that matter. You're more than welcome to play around with the other sections of the website. And I encourage you to do that. But all you should need when you're doing your stuff is bookings and subscriptions. All right. So I'm going to put a little drop down here next to me. And this is all you're going to need to remember to do. Step one, log in to the website under our member portal. Okay. Step two, book your next appointment. If you're a new client or a client who is returning with a package or they just want to book a single session, step number three is come to session. Okay. It's that simple. So step one, log in. Step two, book your appointment. Step three, come to session. And I guess there is a like to be like, if you need to purchase a program, feel free to do that anytime. But when it comes to booking, it's log in, book, come to session. Okay. If you have any questions, you can visit our contact section on the website and send me an email, or you can call us at 513-818-3011, and you're going to reach me, Ariel. Okay. I hope that clears up any confusion that you might be having. And again, we are more than happy to walk you through anything that is coming up or that is challenging for you.